Miss Renee. Can you guess what the letter is this week? I'm going to show you some pictures and I want you to try to figure out what they are so you can guess what the letter is. Here we go. This is something you eat. Can you guess what that is? Here's something that crawls on the ground. This is something you fly in. Do you know what that is? This is a hard one. Do you know what that's called? And this is on a boat. Do you know what that is? Okay, let's go through them again. And I want you to listen and see if you can figure out the sound at the beginning of the word. That's going to tell you what the letter is. This is an apple. Did you figure out what that was? That's an ant. What do we fly in sometimes? An airplane. Did you figure out what this was? That's an arrow. You can go in different directions. And then, this one was hard. This is an anchor that goes on a boat. Do you know what the letter is this week? Did you guess? It's the letter A. Did you guess right? I hope so. Let's do something with our fingers and our hands. I want you to touch your nose, touch your chin. That's the way the game begins. Touch your eyes, touch your knees. Now pretend you're going to sneeze. Are you ready? Chew. Touch your hair, touch your ear, touch your two red lips right here. Touch your elbow where it ends. And that's the way this touch game ends. Let's do our flannel board story that goes with our letter A. We're going to do alligators. Okay, are you ready? One little alligator wondering what to do. Another comes along. And then there are two, two little alligators swimming near a tree. Another comes along and then there are three, three little alligators swimming near the shore. Another comes along and then there are four, four little alligators swim, splash, and dive. Another comes along. And now there are five, five little alligators having lots of fun. Mama calls it's time for bed. And now their fun is done. Let's count the alligators. One, two, three, four, five. Let's do a song that has to do with ants that begins with the letter A. And if you notice, I have some sticks. You can get these sticks at the library with our story time kits, or you can go and get some wooden spoons if you don't have sticks at home, or you can just clap your hands. 
we're going to sing just three verses. And if you want, you can march around the room. I'm just going to sit here, or you can just tap your sticks along with me. Okay, so that's what we're going to be doing. Are you ready? The ants go marching one by one. Hoorah, hoorah. The ants go marching one by one. Hoorah, hoorah. The ants go marching one by one. The little one stops to suck his thumb and we all go marching down to the ground to get out of the rain boom 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 the ants go marching two by two hoorah hoorah the ants go marching two by two hoorah hoorah the ants go marching two by two the little one stops to tie his shoe and we all go marching down to the ground to get out of the rain boom 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 the ants go marching three by three hoorah hoorah the ants go marching three by three hoorah hoorah the ants go marching three by three the little one stops to pat his knee and we all go marching down to the ground to get out of the rain boom 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 and we're going to stop right there but you can continue on if you would like thanks for joining i have a craft that goes along with our letter of the week which is the letter a and we're going to have different animals that you can make into a magnet. There's all different kinds. I don't know what one you will get, but it is an animal, and you'll be able to put it together, and then you can hang it maybe on your refrigerator or even just play with it. And there's instructions on where to put everything because there's some stickers in there to put on the googly eyes and some of the other things. But you need to come to the library and pick up the kit that goes with the Guess the Letter of the Week. I also found some books within the library. This is Angelina Cinderella, and it is by Catherine Holabird. There's also art, and art is by Patrick McDonald. There's Alphabet's Alphabet. Isn't that silly? And that is by Chris Harris. And the other one I found was All Overboard. And that is by James Stevenson. Can you find other books at the library that begin with the letter A? Come and tell me. I would love to know. And I will see you again soon. Bye. Bye.